Den 25. maj stemmer Danmark om den fælles patentdomstol, og Europa må betegnes som opfindernes kontinent. Hvert år tager europæiske opfindere og selskaber patent på ca. 30.000 nye opfindelser. Det er mere end i USA, Kina og Sydkorea til sammen. Mød nogle af dem i serien Fascinerende opfindelser. Third of all women will be affected. Traditional treatment methods, however, often do not produce the desired results. The reason for this is that the tumors are as diverse as the individuals who have them. Physicians have long dreamed of being able to treat cancer using custom treatments. For example, they could replace diseased cells with healthy DNA material from a patient. This is a vision that may soon become reality. This man has created a breakthrough technology that helps sequence the DNA in cells quickly and cheaply. This is Paul Nurein from Sweden. This method, which is referred to as pyrosequencing, means that you decipher the genetic code and then use it to solve various problems. This method is mainly used to analyze various diseases, such as cancer. Before the invention of pyrosequencing, decrypting the genetic code of a person took 13 years and cost around a hundred million dollars. Now, thanks to Nurin's idea, the process runs automatically. For just $8,000, the entire sequence of a cell can be read in just two months. Nurin's quick and inexpensive DNA analysis now makes it possible for cancer researchers to develop therapies tailored to each individual patient. The idea for how to quickly sequence DNA didn't come to Nurin in the lab. Rather, it came to him at night while riding a bicycle. I got the idea one evening in January when I was riding a bike from the laboratory in Cambridge to Fullbourne, a small town. I was very excited about this idea, which was to use the fireflies' light signals. I wanted to tell my wife about it and then test it right away. Here's how Nurin's DNA decryption process works. Our genetic information is laid out like a ladder. To find out how it is arranged, Nurain cut the ladder in half lengthwise and then put the two halves back together again, rung by rung. The scientists then add the four base units and phosphorus to a container. One after the other, the apparatus samples through all the building blocks. When there's a hit, the phosphorus produces a flash. A computer registers the light and records the appropriate block. Nuren's inventions continue to decrypt the Book of Life, thus to understand the language of diseased cells. His wife, Maya, was the first person he told about his idea. I was very excited on that evening when I realized the magnitude of this idea. I wanted to tell my wife about it immediately. On the other hand, I was very nervous because I thought maybe someone would beat me to it. Today, pyrosequencing is one of the most used methods in genetic engineering. It's an invention that can help save lives. It's really great to develop something and believe that it has a real use. It's really special to be able to help people or others in their research. For this brilliant idea, Paul Nurin has now received a nomination for the European Inventor Award from the European Patent Office in the category Small and Medium-Sized Enterprises. We will see if we can take home the Technology Oscar at the award ceremony on the 28th of May in Amsterdam. Programmet vises med støtte fra Europa-nævnet.